everyone, Morgan here. So, today I was supposed to be doing a salve. It's been a really long day. I just didn't have it in me to um, do something like that. I mean, it's really, really super simple, but what I really wanted to do right now is to practice some archery. Now, if you've been following my Instagram, you know that I am working to improve um, my accuracy with my recurve. I love my recurve. And like 14s or so years ago, um, I used to be the bomb at the recurve. But ever since I got into the compound, um, I really never touched a recurve again. So um, once this was gifted to me, I decided that I was gonna get back into it. And um, I'm dedicating this month of August to try to get out at least once a day um, to shoot it. So down there I have my target. I am going to be fairly close to it um, because I, you know, I need to get my accuracy down. What's been happening is I've actually, like every time I aim, it'll actually go up and to the right. So I'm going to use the bottle as a little better target. I don't know, maybe it'll help, but it'll at least be dramatic effect. <laughs> so as you can see, I'm pretty close. You know, again, I'm trying to just get that accuracy and get that point in which I'm consistently hitting where I want to hit um, so you know I'm gonna be fairly close to it and just try to work it out um, you know even with the recurve you know I, this is a 35 pound draw and um, you know I couldn't get that far anyway it's like 15 maybe 20 yards with a recurve so you know I wouldn't be able to get that far anyway but once I get that consistent you know shooting where I want um, I'll move back the closest to where I've aimed in a long time. That was almost right on to where I was aiming. But still, it is slightly high into the right. I was aiming kind of more like here. But I am, you know, narrowing it in. And yes, uh, this is made out of Gorilla Tape. I could use probably a better arrow, but <laughs> this one is actually doing pretty good so far. Oh, same spot. But I am consistently getting that high into the right. I just need to narrow it down to where I'm actually aiming. <laughs> Again, exact same spot almost. Got it. It was slightly off from where I was aiming, but let me try again. Yes, that was exactly where I was aiming. I think I figured it out. So when I let go of the recurve, I think I kind of jerk it a little <laughs> and that makes the arrow kind of go crazy. Um, I jerk it because it's a little bit different than a compound. This kind of is wild and I feel like it's just gonna like fly down and go crazy. With a compound, I'm nice and steady, you know, I can just let it go. But I can do that with this too. Let's see if I'm right. And also take a look. Boom, baby. All right, I think I'm getting tired now. <laughs> um, but, you know, archery is like my meditation. It's my time to just relax and, and focus. I mean, with archery, I'm just like super focused. You know, everything disappears. So I like to try to do this as much as I can because it really does help recenter me. Um, you know, whether it's at the end of the day, beginning of the day, whatever, but whew. Anyway, if anyone has any tips on how to improve my accuracy with uh, my recurve, I know that a lot of people don't tilt the, the bow. Even when I don't tilt the bow, I'm still getting the same response. It's a little high and to the right, or sometimes just period, a little high. So um, I do need help getting back into recurve archery shape. So definitely let me know any tips you can down below or any encouragement for me or anything. Um, one day I would really love to be able to hunt uh, with my recurve and I know I need new arrows so don't give me any tips on that I know I need that uh, thank you all so much for watching uh, conquer tomorrow by preparing today talk to you tomorrow bye